And damn it! I'm telling you, no matter how many times I look, I come up with squat! Same here. <laughs> Tongue, the licking Pokemon, a normal type. When Licky Tongue eats something new, it never forgets how that food tastes or smells. Please don't. Mm. I actually wrote, please do. Thank you. Thank you. You have a very generous tongue. Does this Licky Tongue belong to anyone? <laughs> Thanks for trying to cheer me up. Anybody? No? Thank you for traveling with us. Please sit back and watch this short informational video welcoming you to Rhyme City. Throughout history, Pokémon have been part of our world. Early humans used to catch them and train them to use their unique powers for the common good. This relationship evolved into what we now refer to as Pokémon Battles. One man changed all of this. Howard Clifford, founder and chairman of Clifford Industries. Diagnosed with a rare degenerative disease, he resigned from his corporation and searched the world for a cure. And it turned out that the cure I was looking for was for me to evolve into a better version of myself. And I discovered how to do that through a partnership with Pokemon. And he wanted to share that discovery with the world. This is what inspired Howard Clifford to build Rhyme City, a place where humans and Pokemon can live side by side. Unlike other regions where Pokemon live in the wild, here we live and work together. No battles, no trainers, no Pokeballs. A stronger, more harmonious world. From all our citizens, welcome to Rhyme City. Hey, yeah. Uh... Whoa! Did you fall in a wood chipper? What the hell even happened? Some chestnuts fell on me, that's all. You should stop by the nurse's office. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It took you long enough. What? Ah! Hi, Tim. Lieutenant Yoshida. You're done with the best of the best. 